Hey guys and welcome to day two of this 10 day program for the awakening of Asnia Chakra. Asnia Chakra is our mental commander center and somehow it's the center that control all the other chakra. It's very connected with the concept of duality and duality is the base of our existence. It's plus and minus, black and white, sun and moon, shadow and light female and mate, and of course, left and right. And for this reason, also today, we will perform some polar asana for the awakening and stimulation of different chakra. And we will conclude with our pranayama for the purification of the Shushunda Nadi and fully activation of Asana Chakra. Prepare your mat that we start our class together for the awakening of Asana Chakra. Today we start this yoga class in a sitting position with a simple cross of the leg, whatever you like it. Your seat bones are well grounded on the floor, the spine is straight, shoulder down. Take your hand to the knee and we take a big inhalation through the nose. We exhale to the mouth and then slowly we close the eyes. With the eyes closed. Try to bring your awareness in the present moment, in the here and now, to letting go any obsessive factor, negative thoughts, negative energy, whatever you don't need in this moment. Soften the body, soften the heart and open the mind. And the next inhale, we take both hands in the front of the chest. In a prayer position, push your palm together, spread your finger. And then we express an intention for this yoga class. From the bottom of your heart. Wish to yourself to find balance, peace, harmony. And calm. And very gently, slowly, at the next inhale, we raise the hand up to the sky. Stretch your back, stretch your spine, look up. Exhale, open your hand and gently, slowly take your hand down to the floor and drop your chin down to the chest. Open your eyes. And from this position, with the top of the finger on the floor, we start to roll the head one side and the other one. Very gently and slowly, it's half circle. And the next one, choose one direction and bring the head also to the back and do a full circle with the head on one side. You can try to synchronize the breath with the movement. Exhale with the head back. Inhale when you drop your chin down. Exhale. Great job. And we change direction. And back to the center, eyes closed, attention focus inside. Again, try to observe the effect of this warm up, especially in the area of the neck. Great job, open your eyes. Great, and then inhale again, arms up to the sky. Look up, exhale. 
take the hand down and this time take your left hand on the floor maybe you can try to go down with your uh, elbow inhale right arms come up stretch and come down and give a nice stretch to your right side really open your shoulder open your chest sit bone grounded both on the floor great job inhale up other side you can go down with the hand maybe with the elbow exhale stretch your left arm great job inhale up again left side down stretch on the right side inhale up stretch on the left great job inhale back to the center exhale great now we take left hand on the floor with the right hand we close the right nostril okay inhale up really open exhale we go down inhale up open and stretch exhale down Great job, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, last one, inhale up, exhale down, inhale, release the right nostril and come back to the center, Exhale to the mount. Eyes close. And we observe the effect of this performance. Fully activation of the left side, the left nostril. The lunar aspect of our self, the more cold, feminine, receptive part. We do the same performance to the other side. So right hand on the floor. With the left, we close the left nostril to the left thumbs. We inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale. Exhale. Last one. Exhale. Release the left nostril. Inhale, come up to the center. Hold the breath for a moment. Exhale to the mouth. Eyes closed. Observe the fully activation of the right side, the right nostril, the masculine, hot, warm part, the more active. And of course, a sense of balance because we just work with both. So we should feel more balance and center. Okay, job. Open your eyes. And from here, gently slowly stretch your leg forward. Shake it just a little bit. Maybe give a nice massage to your knee. And we do a foot circle with the feet one side and the other one. And then from here, bend your knee. Rolling forward, we come in a tabletop position just for a moment. We stretch one time the spine up and one time we arching back. We come back to the center, tucking your toes, push your hips up, down dog. And looking forward, baby step through your hands. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale down, inhale, arms up to the sky. Exhale, close to Samastadihi. And from here, come in the front of your yoga mat that we do a couple of rounds of sun salutation to warm up the body. And then we will perform our polar asana. Okay, so if the feet are parallel, spine straight, shoulder down. Nice alignment to the spine and the hips. Inhale, arms up to the sky. 
Exhale, we're bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, right leg go back. Knee to the floor, look up. Inhale, exhale, left leg go back. Inhale, right leg forward. Exhale, left leg forward. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, down. Left side, inhale, arms up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, left leg back, knee to the floor. Inhale. Exhale, right leg back. Down dog. Inhale, left leg forward. Exhale, right leg forward. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, close the master here. Great job. Again, your right side. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Look up. Exhale, right leg back. Inhale, left leg back, down dog. Exhale, knee to the floor, chin and chest to the floor, zigzag pose. Inhale, sliding forward, come up to cobra. Exhale, back to down dog. Inhale, right leg forward. Exhale, left leg. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, close. And again, left side, inhale, arms up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, left leg back. Inhale, right leg back. Down dog, exhale, knee to the floor, chin or chest to the floor. Inhale, sliding forward. Cobra, exhale, back down dog. Inhale, left leg forward. Exhale, right leg forward. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, close. Great job. And again, inhale, arms up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, right leg, go back. Look up. Here we stretch the left leg and we come at the back. Exhale, we bend him forward. Breathing here. Inhale, bend again back the left leg. Both hands on the floor, raise up your right knee just for a moment. And left leg go back, down dog. Knee to the floor, chin and chest to the floor. Inhale, come up. Exhale, back down dog. Right leg come forward, left knee on the floor, look up. Exhale, stretch your right leg and keep your hips back down, bending forward. Inhale, bend the right knee, raise up your left knee just for a moment. Left leg forward. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, close. And down. Great job. We do left side now. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, left leg, go back, knee to the floor. Stretch your right leg. Exhale, bending. Inhale, bend the right knee, raise up the left just for a moment. Right leg back, down dog. Inhale, left leg forward. Look up again, stretch, and then stretch the left leg back, bending forward. 
Great job. Bend your left knee. Raise up the right just for a moment. And right leg forward. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, close the master here. And down. Great job with the eyes closed. Attention focus inside. Try to observe the effect of this sun salutation. The waking up of all the muscles of the body. A warm sensation overall and an increase of energy. Hmm. And gently slowly open your eyes and from here we will perform our first polar asana. So come in a steady position with the feet separate apart, open like the hips, spine straight, left hand come to the hips. We start on the right leg, so shift your weight on the left side. Option one, you just raise up your right leg and you uh, take your hand on the knee and this will be perfectly okay. Second option, you grab your big toes with the two yogi finger and then you stretch your leg. Here, I want to bring your attention about the fact that if you can bring your big toes, but the final position will be something like that. It's much better to keep your spine straight and put your hand on the knee because this is where we want to work with the spine straight. We don't want to crook the, our spine to grab our big toes. Okay, this is very important. So again, choose what is available for you today and respect your practice, respect your body and you are exactly where you're supposed to be. So don't judge yourself if you feel that the knee today is where you can work well with your line and balance, go for it, okay? So we start together, big inhalation, shift the weight on the left side, grab the knee or the toes, spine straight, shoulder down, smiling, one, two, three, four, five, at the next inhale, we open to the side. If you are the, grab the knees again, same thing. So just on the knee, breathing. One, two, three, four, five, Exhale, back to the center. Here we bend the knee and we bring our right sole on the left height. If this is not available, you can take your feet on the calf muscles or actually also on the floor, wherever you like it. It's the tree pose. So really find a good alignment also here. Hips and shoulder are square in line. Hand to the hips, step one. And in prayer position, step two, and up, step three, and breathing. If you want to really challenge yourself, you can close your eyes. Great job, exhale, both hands in the center of the chest. Or if you can, grab your elbow at the back and the right leg go back. So hips are square, again here everybody grab the elbow at the back. Inhale, open the chest, look up to the sky. Exhale, with bending forward. And breathing. Great job, feel the stretch on the left side. Try to keep your hips and shoulders square and look your big toes. The next inhale, come up. Exhale, release. 
and shake it a little bit, eyes closed, try to feel the difference between the left side and the right side. And again, the effect of this performance, of this sequence of asana. Mm. And be ready to do the other side. So again, find a good alignment, open your feet, hand to the hips. Now we shift the weight on the right side and we raise up the left leg. Same rules, knee or big toes, wherever it's comfortable. Inhale deep, smiling, and one, two, three, four, five. Inhale deep, exhale open. Great, one, two, three, four, five, exhale, back to the center, bend your left, three pulls, both hand to the hips, step one, step two, prayer position in the center of the chest, step three, arms up, breathing. Exhale, hand in the chest, or if you can again grab your elbow now, and the left leg go back. Square your hips, everybody grab the elbow, inhale, look up. Exhale, bending forward. Inhale, length and spine. Inhale, come up. Exhale, release. And shake it. Take a moment here with the eyes closed. Gain attention, focus inside. Observe the effect of this performance of this asana in a sense of balance. Mm. Great. Open your eyes and again feet parallel. And inhale, arms up. Exhale, we bend forward. And we take a moment here. Here you can take your hand on the floor or maybe you can grab your elbow if you prefer. What is important is that you really relax the head, the neck, the shoulder. Let the gravity do the work for us and really stretch the spine and create space between the vertebra. Inhale, lengthen the spine, look up. Exhale, here we raise up the heel, we come on the top of the toes, we start to bend the knee and gently slowly we come down and we sit on our heel with the seat bone. Try to find the balance here and when you feel ready, bring your elbow to the knee, hand together and the chin come in the middle of the hand. If you really want to complete this pose, you can look in the middle of the high brown with both eyes. This is a really good pose for stimulate focus and concentration, and of course, awakening Asna Chakra. And gently slowly release. <laughs> And come in a sitting position, stretch your leg forward, 
shake it mm. great and from here we do our performance of a lasagna so find the way back down on the floor great prepare yourself and when you feel ready raise up your hips and enter in the pose And start again with the end on the back. Maybe then when you feel more comfortable, take your arms down on the floor with the palm of the hand on the floor. Or maybe interlock your finger, palm together, push down. The toes can be tucking in, or if you prefer, you can point your toes forward and this is, will give a little bit more stretch at the leg and the ankle. And when finally you find the good alignment and you feel comfortable in the pose, close your eyes and move your attention in the area of the forehead. Feel the activation of Hadna Chakra. That's also overall a feeling of calm and peace. Again, this is a great pose to calm down. And gently, slowly come back. Bring your hand to the back with control. Maybe raise up your leg just for a moment. And then one vertebra at a time. Come down, lie down on the floor. Mm. Take a moment here. The eyes close. Relax completely. Bend your knee to the chest. Give a nice hug to your knee and stretch the muscles of the back. Start to roll a bit one side to the other one. And then we do a big circle with the knee to massage the low back. The lower back one side and the other one. And from here, we start to roll back and forward with the idea to massage the spine, but also to move the energy from down to upward and we'll end in a sitting position for the performance of our pranayama. So we come in a sitting position Simple cross of the leg, spine straight, shoulder down. We will perform us now Nadi Sodana with a ratio of 1, 4, 2, 2. And it's important that you try to keep the performance steady and with no stop between one cycle and the other one. We start with a deep inhalation to the nose and forcefully exhalation to the mouth and then we go for, with our performance. Like as usual, I will guide you for the first cycle and then I let you performance uh, your pranayama. Okay, great job. So we inhale deep to the nose, except to the mouth once. 
close your right nostril, inhale to the left, hold the breath, Exhale on the right. External retention. Inhale on the right. Hold. Exhale left. External retention, and this is one cycle. And then I let you perform your at your time and your pace. And that will do. Remember to finish with the exhalation on the left side. The one you finish with the eyes closed, both hand to the knee. Observe the effect of this pranayama. The purification of the Shushuna Nadi. The activation of Adnya Chakra. And overall a sense of peace and calm. And of course, harmony. And with the eyes closed, we go directly on the meditation. We start observing the breath. 
in and out to the nostril. To feel the warm and cold sensation of the air in and out on the upper part of the lip. Try to soften it with the muscles of the body and the face to calm down the mind, calm down the breath. And really try to refine your attention in the upper part of the lips. Observe any sensation in this area. And very gently, slowly, we move our awareness from the area of the lips to the area, to the center of the forehead, the location of Asna Chakra. And again, we concent, concentrate all the attention on this small area, on this small spot in the middle of the forehead. To observe if there is any physical sensation. It can be a tingly, cold, warm. Whatever sensation is present is perfectly okay. But really try to focus, concentrate, and restrict the attention to this small area in the middle of the forehead. And then we image from the universe a string of gold light start to pierce and penetrate Asna Chakra. And gently slowly, like a liquid gold, we feel this energy move down to all our being. We refill all our being with golden light directly from the universe to our Asna Chakra to the rest of the body, to the rest of the system. We are completely full and recharge of this golden light. Is a healing light that creates protection all around ourselves and clear for all negative sensation and negative energy. And gently, slowly, start to move your attention to the external. Observe the effect of this meditation, of this practice. Fully activation of Asna Chakra. And fully recharge and protect from the gold light. And gently, slowly, at the next inhale, take your hand together in the front of the chest in a prayer position. Take a smile in your face and be thankful with yourself for this practice. Thankful with the universe for this amazing energy, for this amazing life.
open your eyes. And with that, I conclude the class of today. I hope that you have enjoyed. Like as usual, like and subscribe and share with your friends. Thank you for your participation, for your presence. Namaste. See you tomorrow.